Okay guys, so the first one we looked at, just for ease of remembering, we're not having this arm, sorry, this leg over his body. It's also going to aid the fact that he's going to do the bailout escape. So we go for an arm bar, he bails out, we step that leg over. As he goes, I kick him into the arm and I've got the finish here. So just literally go into like a, a mermaid S sit, and then I put pressure with my knee on his shoulder and try and touch his hand to his back. If he's up like this and I want to finish it a bit more successfully, I just scoot away to collapse his base and then again push down with my knee, lean across and get the tap. Okay. The next one was the omoplata escape. So we're in this position. Now to make it easy, obviously I can't go up because he's blocking me and I also can't step over. So I base up into a tripod with my head on the ground and my toes on the ground. I step in with my outside leg, flatten myself, roll him over my body, and continue up, and we're in a scramble. Okay. Then, I'm going to look at what do we have next? Omoplata reversal. So, we've got an omoplata, struggling to finish it, so what I'm going to do is grab his sleeve with my near side hand, fall back with my outside hand, Reach over and grab his trouser leg. Straighten it, bring it over my body, roll, and step over into like an S sit. And then the final one, stand in the guard, please. So, as we did before, grab his sleeve with an opposite grip. He stands up, take my free hand, feed it through his legs, switch the grip, take my now free hand, reach up, grab his collar, open my legs. Kick him towards his head, roll, I need to free this hand to allow me to progress, and again, up into an S-sit. Okay. Alright, cheers.